Being stranded alone in outer space may sound like torture to you, yet one man managed to live almost a year up there just after the Soviet Union collapsed. Selected to become a cosmonaut in 1985, engineer Sergei Krikalev showed great promise in his training. And three years later, he was sent aboard Mir, the first modular space station. Due to economic constraints suffered by the Soviet Union, the Soviets didn't have the funds to send new crew members aboard Mir. And, acquired over a long career as head engineer, Krikalev had a very particular set of skills, so he volunteered to stay alone on Mir, at least until they managed to send more cosmonauts, making him the only human in space at the time. But, in December 1991, the Soviet Union collapsed, leaving Krikalev stranded, as the landing area for the Soviet program was now located in the newly independent Kazakhstan. Things were looking grim for Krikalev. After one long, lonely year on Mir, NASA agreed to a joint program to operate the station, which finally made the rescue of Krikalev possible. He remained in space twice as long as originally planned, spending a total of 311 days in space, and gaining the honorary title of the last Soviet citizen. 